Oregon, it's not just their offense, but their whole uh, team. The, the thing that jumps out about them is their speed. Uh, they have great speed at all their skill positions. They do a, a tremendous job of making you defend the whole field, uh, vertically and, and horizontally. So uh, you have to be uh, – they run essentially option football, and so you have to be assignment conscious. And, uh, you know, we uh, – we have to be very disciplined this week on defense to, to limit big plays and try to uh, force them into situations where we could have the upper hand on the defensive side. You know, this, this team hasn't been beaten much, you know, so I don't know if there's, quote, a blueprint out there. Um, you know, we, uh, we feel good about our game plan and, and what we have set up that, that's going to give us a chance. You know, like you said, we'll be huge underdogs, and, and that's all right. Uh, it's, uh, it's, it's really a matter about us focusing on what about us. You know, the team, we need to handle us and, and make sure we do what we're supposed to do and what we're capable of doing and then see what happens. Uh, we can't get caught up in, in Oregon and, and all the other stuff that they do. We have to make sure that, we're, it's, that, that we focus on us and focus on the things we need to do. Um, everybody's tried a lot of different things to beat them. I think when you look at the teams that have beaten them, they've done what their identity is, what they're about, better than what Oregon did, what they were about. That's how you beat Oregon. You have to do what you do better than what they do. Uh, so, but to say there's a blueprint out there, I haven't seen one yet. I, I guess I had to Google it, huh? <laughs> Tell them to focus on today and then focus on the task at hand. You know, like I said, no one's going to feel, you know, it is what it is, right? I mean, we can't, we can't control that. And we got to worry about what we can control. That's effort. That's being assignment sound. That's playing as fast as we can play. And that's when an opportunity comes to make a play, try to do it. You know, but uh, you're not going to get woe is me, you know, and I'm not going to let the guys on the team walk around and sulk about it either. You know, we have a great opportunity this week. We get to play Oregon, and uh, that's how they have to look at it. If they look at it any other way, you know, they, it's not. <laughs> you know, we, we, show, we, we show flashes every game. You know, offensively, we show flashes every game. Of being able to run it, we have to get consistency. You know, our identity hasn't developed because we haven't been consistent in what we want to do. You know, we flash whether it's a quarter, a half, and so we have to, you know, get better at that. We took a step back in our pass protection. You know, we got what, five sacks. We were sacked five times, I think, something like that last week. And uh, I thought we had been doing pretty well on that front. So, you know, right now, for our identity, it's, it's really about consistency and what we're trying to do, be it run the ball, be it play physical. We took a step back tackling, I felt like, last week a little bit. And part of that could be due to, you know, guys are beat up. You know, you, you don't maybe go in there with the same intensity that you do when you're feeling good, you know. So, uh, but we have to continue to stay the course. We have to continue to work on getting better and work on being consistent.